This is a pipe cleaner pin curl video. In the video, I'm just showing you how to use pipe cleaners, how I double them, um, the correct way to use them. And what I'm showing you here is I have a free end and I use it and wrap it around the pipe cleaner at the base, the open end. And I take it and I seal, it, seal the hair onto it and I curl it. While I'm curling it, I just take the hair, pull it straight, pull both sides straight, and where the holes are, I just take it and tuck the tail into the hole, creating a pink curl. And I'll, voila. Here you are again, taking the hair. There's different ways you can do it, but I'm doing it uh, a pin curl where, where it lays flat on the scalp. I take two um, pipe cleaners, put them together. One end is free, and the other end is has a, has a uh, closed end hoop to it. I close the base with the, end, with the free end, and I curl the hair up, and I push the hair down. If it's too long, it's, this is not long hair. I take both ends, the tail and the open end, and put the tail into the open end like a little half circle. Again, open and close. Free end is there, the loops are on the other side. And then I twist around the pipe cleaner, seal it with the base. Just one push, and then I curl. And some of them I have two pipe cleaners, depending on if it's two locks or if the locks are thick. And some I'll just have one. Where the loop is, where the free tail is, I put the free tail into the loop and voila. Sometimes people like to wear them as styles. This is a thicker one, so I may use, I think I'll use two, use one. I think I'll use two. And pipe cleaners come in all different colors. They come in different colors and different sizes. So on this one, I'm using two because the hair is thicker and it won't uphold to uh, one, so I put two on there because the base is thicker, or if I'm using two locks. Spin around, spin around, spin around, close the deal at the end, curl, 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 curl. The loop end is there and the free end is there. Put it inside the loop, boom. You have a curl. And this is a, these are called pin curl. Or pin curls. You can order these pipe cleaners at a art store. You can go to Amazon and go online, depending on what country you're in. I don't know how they do in other countries, but I'm in the USA. Um, you can um, just order regular pipe cleaners, clean pipes. They last a long time, and they also are easy to clean. You can have your own ones for your special clients, put the name on the bag, or for yourself. And if you have, you know, if you don't have a clientele. It's a cool, easy way to walk around with the style as well as um, take them out and have really tight, tight, springy, bouncy curls. So on that one, I was just showing you how if the hair is long, you can push the, the locks down and then get more space on the pipe cleaner. So you can really do it with very long hair, but just it'll be a little tighter, that's all.
And the thing about styling and videos is this style, this video um, or this technique may be a very old technique, but you would be surprised on how many people have never seen it. So the internet and YouTube has allowed us to reach more people. So when I went to Africa to buy my dreadlock machines, um, they'd never seen this technique before. So sometimes techniques are not um, in different uh, regions, countries, cities, um, and you just you keep if you keep doing them, uh, you can probably teach people something new. Some people have already seen it a million times; they've done it a million times, but um, a lot of people haven't seen this technique. And so we just keep showing it because people are asking, you know, or telling us, oh, my God, I did this style and it was great. And I'm, I bought them from Amazon and so forth and so on. So you just keep giving knowledge to people. Sometimes people have it. Sometimes they don't. But it's a good to be in a situation where you can teach people and continuously like grow people's like awareness. Here, two pipe cleaners. I'm using different colors as well. Just to show you, you can buy many different colors. Uh, they, they're all the same strength, uh, depending on which one you buy. Um, they have big ones, they have fl fluffy ones for art, they have soft ones, they have firm ones. We use the very firm ones uh, and because they can really hold and maintain the hair. Sorry, it's a little blurry right there. Sometimes the camera takes, takes a while to catch up and get into focus on its own. Contemplating what we can be one to and get to myself. I done me.